It's truly amazing That spirit of Christmas Good morning. Good morning. Before I can see how to read their names. Oh, I can see. I can look here. Yeah. So, um, Molly is putting some little Christmas packets together for Elodie's and Ruby's teachers. She's um, giving away some yarn and some hand knits. So, so, so nice of Molly. And then socks for two of the teachers. Mm -hmm. Some mittens, right? Fingerless mittens. Mm -hmm. And socks for three of the teachers. Oh. Fingerless mittens and a shawl. Wow, they are so lucky, I think. But um, they are so nice also. And yeah, they take care of our children, so we crazy are grateful for them. Mm -hmm. We are. And I know that they like these. I know they will appreciate it. Exactly. I'm having a copy and Elodie had another night with fever, but Ruby is still um, good and Molly and I are still good, so yeah, hopefully Elodie will get back on her feet very soon. Good morning. Just finished watching ALF, which has been a lot of fun. Haven't seen it yet this year. Have you guys watched ALF yet this year? Such a fun, good one, filled with lots of laughing, I think, anyway. So I've just come down to the studio. Tomorrow will be my last full work day. Tomorrow is also Tina's last full work day. I also see that I have some DPD orders here and I have a DPD pickup today, so I better do those first. I hadn't planned on packaging orders, actually. I had planned on putting together all of my new sock sets. However, seeing as though DPD will probably be here in the next two hours or so, I'm going to pack all of those German orders first. Then I'll do my sock sets, then I'll pack the remainder of orders. I am wearing, could this be Brioche Delicious by Dre Renee Nitz, Andrea Mowry. I'm pretty sure that's what this is. I don't remember the colorway though that I used for this. Hmm, I know it's oatmeal. And the super colorful skein, I don't remember at all. It's really pretty though. Anyway, I loved knitting this. I don't wear it that often because it's just not like long enough, but I do enjoy wearing it over my shoulders. And I just recently rediscovered it when I was looking for um, like shawls that I've never worn, that I've just knit and never ever worn. And uh, yeah, I found this. This is one that I have worn though. And I thought I'd put it over my shoulders today.
I have all of the orders packed that Robert printed, but it looks like a bit have come in since he did that. So maybe I'll get to those either today or tomorrow. We'll see. And now I'm about to head upstairs. I guess I'll get to it tomorrow. It looks like Robert's headed to the post now, right? So we're gonna start making kind of random food because we don't have enough for one meal, but we have enough for a few meals. But first, but first we have to wash off the counter a little bit. We have potatoes on the stove Ooh, with leftover potatoes from our crautulada that we made yesterday. And then, I know this looks super appetizing, right? <laughs> we have one potato that I set aside for the crautulada and uh, one and a half crautulada. Ruby finishes school before Erodi. Well, Erodi's not going to school because she's sick this week which we mentioned last night, there's no way. No way she'll be going before Christmas break. And uh, so Ruby usually stays as long as Adri has school at her school. And uh, today she asked if she could be picked up for lunch. So Robert's, as I already said, he's on his way getting her right now. And so that lunch will be for all of us. Polly is oh, being the cutest little cutie. I just finished listing a kit to the shop. I have in the Bleak Midwinter kit. It's so sweet. It comes with the prettiest little reindeer hot cocoa charm. Love these. There are a ton of these kits in the shop. So if you want one, you definitely will be able to get one. I hope, I hope, hope, hope. And then you can get a skein of apple crumble which once this is gone, I'm not going to be dyeing it until next year, probably for the shop. Um, you have different choices of different bases. I think there's soft sock decay, fingering, weight, merino, and then a merino cashmere nylon decay. And you got this gorgeous handled drawstring bag. I love how deep, dark, and gray this bag is. I can hear Erodi in the living room. She's writing a book. She really loves writing like little stories. Um, she's done one about a princess before. Just one about a girl and her mom who do things together. What all has she done them about? She really, really loves SpongeBob. Loves SpongeBob. I feel like she knows everything about SpongeBob. And so she's writing a SpongeBob story. It is very sweet and I can hear her reading it out loud right now. Polly is on the lookout. She is waiting for someone to bark at. That's her little hedgehog next to her. She loves to she loves us to throw it to her. Polly Polly! Come here, Polly! Come here, Tippies! See, she's like, oh, she wants to play with me. She wants to play with me. Come here, Tippies! Give me the eagle. Give me the eagle. Eagle means hedgehog in German. Give me the eagle, Polly. Give me the eagle. Give me the eagle. Give me the eagle. And she knows what it means. If you ask for eagle, she'll grab you her eagle. If you ask for her ball, she'll grab you her ball. But I want the eagle. Now that I want it, she suddenly wants it. <laughs> oh, crazy, crazy, you're so crazy. I would guess you guys don't want to watch longer than that of a clip of Polly. <laughs> I think it's only we who are the owner of the dog that enjoy watching videos and clips of them. But I'm putting it in there anyway. Yeah, I'm
Hand over the spit. <laughs> 